Hello everyone, my name is Binks and wanted to say Happy New Year! Oh wow, I can't believe how fast 2023 went by, it's insane. Ah, oh, I know, I, I feel like that every year, but like really this year was crazy. Um, but yeah, this is not only a Happy New Year video, but also a quick little update. Um, I... I'm sad. <laughs> because I the last update video I gave to you guys probably, I think, was like the end of last year. I had such big information for you that I had gotten a new PC and I was super excited and I was planning to move to the second floor apartment in my two flat building. And just a lot of things have happened and gotten in the way of those plans. Um, we did renovate half of the apartment, so the office is pretty much done, the bedroom is pretty much done, the bathroom is somewhat done and livable. Um, so I could move up there, but uh, the heat is not really working very well up there. And the biggest issue is the electricity. The wiring and everything is outdated and it needs to be, um, the outlets need to be grounded. Because it is not safe to plug in a powerful appliance or electronic devices that uh, will unfortunately potentially start a fire or, you know, get damaged if you plug them into ungrounded outlets. And the problem is that this building is old and everything is really really outdated and, and bad the fact that i've been able to use my old computer and all that i'm lucky but i i have sneaking suspicion even now that my my setup my current setup is not really safe either so we've been lucky we've been blessed but uh moving forward when i move upstairs i want to be safe better safe than sorry so uh, it's been a struggle to find a trustworthy electrician. They're very uh, unreliable. All the ones that we've tried uh, have different excuses and different things happening why they fell through. And people who said they would help us did not help us. So it's, it's just been really, really frustrating this whole year. And then we had some other uh, situations popping up like my mom needing three surgeries back to back to back. Um, she got a, a knee replacement and then uh, like a, a week or two after she fell and the surgery location busted open and she needed another surgery and then she got an infection in the area. So she had three surgeries and uh, her health was at risk and it was very scary. So that that whole like the rest of our summer that happened in August so August, September, October was very stressful and scary for us. Um, so nothing got accomplished during that time other than, you know, taking care of her. So it's been a rough year. <laughs> it's been really rough and I still have not been able to use my new computer and I'm very upset about it. But it is what it is. So the main thing about that is unfortunately uh, what I'm going to show to you right now is the message that has been popping up on my Steam for almost a whole year. So if you don't know, which you should if you play video games, but uh, Steam is the application, the, the service that a lot of us are able to utilize in order to play video games, right? That they, they house a lot of games for us. And apparently because my computer is so old, uh, Steam will no longer be supported on this computer as of December 31st, I think, or, or just starting on January 1st. So I've known about it for a while and I was racing, as I kept hinting during my LPs, uh, I was racing to try and finish the games I was playing on Steam. You know, the Paranorma site, uh, the Lovingly Evil, you know, er anything I could because I knew if I didn't have the new computer up and running in time that come the new year I will no longer be able to play Steam games on this computer. So the solution would have been of course if this computer if I could have updated it from Windows 7 to Windows 10 but when the time came and they had the option and I tried to up update it this computer had some kind of message I don't remember exactly what it said but basically that it, it couldn't even transition 
that it was too old. Um, it didn't have the necessary, I don't know, I'm not very tech savvy, but it wasn't able to cross over. So I'm still using a computer on Windows 7 and I know I'm not the only one, <laughs> I'm sure. I've had this computer since 2010 or 2011 and it's still kicking, but it's slow and there's a lot of things I can't do with it. And now this is just one more thing to add to the pile that I cannot play Steam games on here anymore. And that makes me sad. So starting, uh, starting soon. The only thing you'll be seeing on this channel, probably for a while, will be um, Investigations 2 once Paranormal Site is over and once my little break is over, because I am going to take a little break. I need it. I'm tired. <laughs> uh, will be Investigations 2 because that's not on Steam. And after that, who knows? I, I'm hoping, I'm praying, I, I've been arguing with my mom about it. I really need to get an electrician so that I can do what I want to do, which is to uh, be able to play a certain Ace Attorney game that's being released on Steam uh, at the end of January. So that's my plan and hope and pray, but uh, if it doesn't happen, well, we'll see. Anyway, hope you guys have a new, uh, a wonderful and safe New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, and uh, hopefully 2024 will be much better and safer and and all of the good things for all of us so thanks for watching thanks for uh your support and i hope you guys all join me in the new year bye bye <laughs>